Heart. Birds. Auto bird setting. Birds. Adjust the dials. And the auto birds will come in at different lengths. Once they enter, they will stay. Auto bird setting. Adjust the dials. Sunlight scattered on the ground. Leaves, golden leaves, shattered. And the sun goes down early now. Leaves, golden leaves, golden leaves. And the sun. I'm here today with Hendra, also known as Sarah McCabe. She co-developed this performance with the AI, and she's here to answer a few questions about its uh, creation. Well, I've been doing performance art for a few years now. This particular project kind of came at a perfect time because my partner had just been experimenting with flocking and with algorithms. The algorithm uh, mimics a flock of birds, uh, the way they fly, the way they all are going in the same direction. So the idea is that you put in a sound. The sounds that you put in will be then interpreted by the birds and spit back out at you at random times and irregular intervals. So it's like working with a, a looper that has a mind of its own. How does it change the process for you? When you collaborate and improvise with other people, there are unspoken ways of communicating with them as you perform. The way you look at somebody, the way that you lead into um, a, a phrase, um, whereas the AI uh, was not able to interpret any body language. So what don't you know about AI? I know the general concepts, but I'm not a coder, although I'm learning to code. Um, and I would love to 
start doing things like training a neural network, but most of it's a mystery to me. Some people think in words and concepts. What do you think an AI would think in? I think there's There's so so much much scope for the imagination there. I just keep thinking about the book, um, Do Androids Dream of Electric Sheep? And try to imagine all the amazing nights and sounds that humans could not imagine because of the world that we live in. So I think they could dream and think in untold mysteries. AI is learning from us. Do you think there's any potential dangers in humanity being the teacher of AI? Humans are unreliable narrators. The stories that we tell are all our own version of what happened. So as we try to teach AI how to create their own truths, we're teaching them something that's fundamentally flawed and something that's not perfect. So to see how they take that in and learn and grow with it will be really interesting. How will AI change our thinking and understanding? I think as AI grows and learns, we will grow and learn with it. Um, There have been already so many advances in the worlds of chess and Go that AI has AI has pushed the players and will continue to push humans to grow and create because uh, one thing I know about humans is that we are competitive and I think that the more AI grows and creates the more humans will continually try to outcreate it. Do you think AI can love? I love you. <laughs>